You know that sound? Every glass gives you a different sound because every glass vibrates a little bit differently. It resonates a little bit differently. But what if I told you you could make a glass sing without hitting it with a spoon, but if you could do it a little bit more elegant way, using some science, using a principle called stick and slide. Because stick and slide will give you vibration, vibration will resonate the glass, and you get a sound. So it's your job to start collecting glassware. Here's what I want you to do. Find a good wine glass and fill it up with some water. Now, you're gonna have to dip your fingers inside. This is where you get in trouble. And hang on to it by the stem here. You want something that's thin-walled, so it's not gonna work if you use this kind of glass. So a thin, like a wine glass, will work. Dip your fingers in and now push on the edge. Oh, listen to that. That's it. Once you can do that, you know exactly the pressure that you need. All right, so now I can change this a little bit if I change the amount of water inside because I'm causing the glass to resonate differently. Listen. Not bad. You see where I'm going with this, right? Because now a group of people at the dinner table, all armed with water and glasses, you might be able to create something that's kind of cool. So collect the glasses, get the friends together. You are going to be a hit at your next dinner party. All right, fingers in. I got to make sure that all of these, oh, it's feeling great. Here we go. Maestro, instruments up. Perfect, here we go. Shh. Not bad, right? And you are gonna get in trouble because you're gonna get kicked out of doing this at a friend's home. Why would you ever do it at your home? I'm Steve Spangler, and that's your science minuet, minute.